Hey, what's up? Leo here. You guys haven't seen me for a while, so I hope you guys are doing well. Now, so what's news in 2020 projects this year? Okay, um, I'm going straight to the problems that we're going to solve. So we're not just learning how to code with the tech stack, also we're trying to solve a real problem. Okay, so I just want you to walk away after you finish this course with something that you can apply immediately, right away. Okay, it could be um, a project for your business, or it could be a portfolio, or it could be something like you can offer for your local business. All right, this is the real deal. Okay, so what's the problem? The problem is that the pandemic pushes small business online. Okay, so since their door closes, they move to the online space, and that's causing the daily volumes of the orders um, raising very sky skyrockets or right, in higher demands. Now, even Amazon is struggling to cope with that cross of order. So what's the solution? Now, the solution is a crowded source um, deliver system, all right, very simple. Now, you know that Uber Eats, DoorDash, um, etc., but just for food. Now, we try to build something uh, more general, uh, more bigger, all right? It could be anything. It could be the parcel or um, the bicycle or even the food, the flower, anything. And anyone can be the driver or the courier not just a big company. Okay, so here's how it works. Quickly, the first step, the customer or the sender just create a job, all right? And a courier just um, pick it up and accept an offer, come to pick it up, deliver and put it back, okay? Now, in the meantime, the customer can track in the orders or the courier's location in real time. That's what it is gonna work, okay? So here's the key thing for this project, the progressive web app. Now, obviously with this sort of solution, you might think that you need to build a mobile app, of course. Um, but for that reason, you need to learn a lot of things. Um, you might need to learn Swift for um, mobile app in Apple. You might need to learn Java for Android, or even you have to learn React Native, okay? That's cool, that's totally cool, but it's gonna take a lot of time. And also we have to uh, build and take a lot of time to go through the Apple Store or Google Store. All right, again, um, it's not cheap and it's gonna take time. So we need to find something um, that we can build quickly, all right, as quick and cheap as possible. That's what we come up with the progressive web app. So basically we just need to use the familiar technologies like HTML, CLS, and JavaScript and build the website and it just like feels and functionality just like the native app okay I'm gonna show you right now so here's what we're going to view now on the right hand side it's just a website just a normal web app okay so Rosie Brown she a shop owner she just created a job okay and deliver a new bicycle so she just created a job post a photo and fill some information um, with her uh, payment details as well. That's what we're going to deal with Stripe and pay out with PayPal in this course. And yeah, so here's the detail, the pick up location, the deliver. And someone just uh, pick up this one. So here. Now, as you can see, I'll just open my browser and um, for, for example, iPhone X. It's just a website, but as you can see, it looks and functionally just like a mobile app. Okay. So um, yeah, so you can track the location of the driver or the courier, I should say. Now, let's just say uh, the courier come to the pickup location. He can click here and take a photo. Yeah, we don't need a native app. We can do that in here on the browser. All right, take photos. Okay, now once I click on the upload pickup photo, notice here it's gonna update in real time without refreshing the page, okay? Look at this. Hey, see that? So now I just uh, got to pick up photo uh, just out of proof, okay? Now we're gonna do the same thing with drop off, but um, that's a key thing. All right, so in this course, uh, you're gonna learn a lot of things. Um, at the moment, it's just a prototype that's um, still working on phase one. Um, a lot of cool things more to come. All right, so with this course, you're gonna be the back end super easy, all right? so. That's why we're going to use the Django framework Python. Uh, you just need to define some very basic 
model like customer, courier, uh, job, and immediately just two line of code, two line of command, I should say, is gonna create the beautiful dashboard for you. So very quick, that's what I love about Django. Now we're gonna, also we're gonna deal with the real payment with Stripe and the payout to the courier with PayPal. And also you're gonna learn to send, um, how to send transactional email. All right guys, I think this one is really cool project. Um, you're gonna learn a lot of things, but in short time, very, very quickly. So don't worry about it. It's gonna long, long uh, project that you don't want to complete at the end, okay? Um, for this one, after you complete this one, you can build a portfolio or put it on your resume, all right? Um, or just simply a new skill that you can build something or create your own startup or something that you can offer your local business like restaurants, um, coffee, shop, etc. All right. Okay. So I can't wait to see you guys. Um, this project is going to be live on a Kickstarter next week. So make sure that you guys are going to check my email for any updates. All right. See you then.